Hello everyone and welcome back to my morning report chart appraisals on Monday the 14th of January with me, Rich Permark and Alice, that handsome marks. Looking at Dol Yen, which I said last week was tracking within this downtrend and the, the pro uh, potential was the fact that we were going to get a consolidation potentially that could start to break that uh, downtrend. Um, it's interesting because Friday we saw a, uh, a second positive candle that has started to break that downtrend, but today's move back lower again with the uh, fall in risk appetite, 50 pips down on dollar yen, is uh, suggesting that the downtrend is intact for now, but it's sort of on the brink really because you look at these MACD lines and certainly this morning when I wrote it, these MACD lines were very close to crossing higher actually. Um, but the mixed indicators come with the fact that the RSI is struggling around 30 and stochastics also rolling over. So the fact is that we've still got this consolidation that is in place. Supports at 107.75. To be honest, 107.75 towards 108 figure really, if you look on this hourly chart. 108 figure is it as well, a basis of support a couple of uh, last week um, and back testing that now. Um, but we're basically tracking sideways and um, the market fell over at 109.10, which obviously is the resistance now. Um, but the resistance of that downtrend comes in around the sort of 108.30 mark today. So it is still intact, this downtrend, and the market is sort of pushing towards the lows and again of that consolidation, 107.75 to 108 figure support band. Um, and if you did get a close below 108 figure and then 107.75, then you are starting to sort of gain a bit of traction to the downside. But for now, this um, this line is holding, but I'm still sort of um, looking towards a corrective dollar generally. And, um, and I think uh, that dollar yen is going to be um, ultimately gaining ground in 2019. So it sort of all sort of pulls into that um, argument anyway. Um, but whether this is the time that we're going to see a breakdown, I'm not quite sure yet. But certainly on a technical basis, we're still sort of suggesting that rallies are a chance to sell. And we've had that rally um, that is starting to sort of fall over again in this consolidation. So it could well be that uh, we're sort of positioning once more for uh, another downside break. But we need to see the confirmation of that. So I wish you good luck in your training. I'll speak to you later.